Hello Pink Fresh friends and welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Leah Lawson and I'm excited today to be doing a product overview of our new release that just went live this morning. This release is a set of layering stencils with some that have coordinating dyes. It's an exciting new concept that I am really excited to share with you. Of course, we have a release blog hop going on with our team and welcome guests, so be sure to get that link in the video description below uh, so you can check out all of the inspiration and uh, comment along the way for all of your chances at the prizes. Okay, so this new release is full of stencils. So we have a couple of slimline stencils, but we've also released a set of A2 background stencils. Now this is the show stealer. So these are layering stencil sets that don't require a stamp set. You will ink blend these beautiful images, and then some of these layering sets also have a coordinating die. So let's take a closer look at all of the products. So up first, we are gonna take a look at the background stencils. Now there are two slimline background stencils and there are five A2 sized background stencils. So up first, this one is called Cloud Builder. I did a sneak peek this on a YouTube Live a couple of weeks ago. So if you caught that, you might've gotten to see it work in action. But basically, it's just two different cloud options on each side. It's nine inches long, so it can fit on um, slimline cards, but it really works for any card. As you can see, I've used it for an A2 sized card here. And it just allows you to create a really dreamy, beautiful cloudscape. Now, we also have the mountainscape layering set. This is three stencils. You create this gorgeous mountainscape background. And this is what it looks like when you use it as is. It's so fun. It makes such a whimsical, but also clean and graphic scene. Um, mine is very wintry, of course, because we are in the middle of uh, winter. So we also have five new A2 size backgrounds. Now we've taken three that we previously released in the slimline size that were the best sellers and we have converted them to A2. And that is Diamond Plaid, Simple Plaid, and Argyle. We've also introduced two new A2 sized background stencils. This one is called Layered Sunburst. It's a three piece stencil set. And this one is called Mirror Triangles. It is actually technically just one stencil, but when you flip the stencil, um, you obviously get many different ways you can use it. But when you flip it specifically, you can actually create this gorgeous shaded background. Now this was inspired by a paper from our Let's Stay Home collection. So if you are familiar with that paper collection, then you, um, this, this stencil might seem a little familiar to you. So those are all of our background stencils. Now they range in price depending on size and how many layers that they have from 550 up to 15 um, and you can get all of that information in the product links below. These are just some really gorgeous samples from our team members and some of our guests using these brand new background stencils. We're super excited with how these turned out. We think that you're going to love creating with them and don't forget to hit up the blog hop for a ton more inspiration using all of these new products that I am introducing to you today. Now up next is the showstoppers of this release. This is the layering stencil sets. So these come in either four or five piece stencil, stencil sets. Now these three that I'm showing you first didn't require or it didn't feel like they needed a coordinating die. So we did not include a die with these ones. But the concept is is you get all of these different stencils to ink blend this gorgeous image. Now, in the upper left corner of these stencils, there is a number, so you know which order to ink blend in. And then there are notches, which are the perfect size of four and a quarter by five and a half to make sure that you line up all of those layers correctly. So here is Floral Circle. This is one I've created. Uh, this kind of um, non-traditional Christmas card, it turned it into an ornament. As we mentioned, these ones didn't need dies, but that circle cuts out perfectly with one of our latest circle dies, the diagonal stitched circles. 
there are two more sets. The This one is called Seamless Floral Pattern. The great thing about this is it's seamless. So while it starts out A2 sized, you can actually um, create it in slumline sized as well. And then finally, that one is Hanging Garden. And what you get is just a gorgeous garden that is coming down from the top of your card. It can also come from the bottom, or if you're doing a slimline, it can come from both sides. Lots of really fun ways to use these stencils. We are very excited about this concept. There is no stamp needed. You get this beautiful no line coloring fill just by ink blending. So these next sets I'm sharing with you are same as the three I just went over. They are four or five piece layering sets. You ink blend your image, but these ones, it felt appropriate to include a coordinating die. So that one I just showed you is called Daisy Wreath. Now this one is called Enchanting Meadows. As you can see, it's just this really beautiful leafy botanicals. And then it also has the die. Now this is one of my favorites. This is Garden Florals. You ink blend this gorgeous bouquet of florals and then you can die cut it or not. And it's just a lovely, soft, it gives you that no line color feel. Um, you can do this in any color of the rainbow. And as you can see, I did use one of those plaid stencils in the background. And they, these really mix and match well with the background stencils that I showed you earlier. This one is called Overlapping Leafy Wreath. I also demoed this this week on YouTube Live on Tuesday. So if you caught it, you got to see it in action. But if not, here is that card that I created live. And then I went ahead and created another one with the practice run the practice wreath that I ink blended before the show. Really perfect for Christmas, but you can easily change up the colors and use this wreath for any season. That is what is great about this entire release is while it wasn't designed with any type of season or sentiment in mind, just by changing the colors, you can make it work for any season, any holiday, any time of year. What we love about that is it is just th this entire re release is so versatile. The stencil sets range from $15 to $17 and the dies range in price from $13 to $16. Now there is a grand prize giveaway on this video so just follow the commenting instructions below. And don't forget about the release blog hop going on. There is ton of, tons of inspiration and a prize at every stop. So make sure you click on the blog hop link below and hop along your way to be inspired and enter for your chance to win. All right, that is everything that I have for you today. Um, I would love for you to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to our channel so you don't miss out on anything in the future. And other than that, I hope you have a wonderful day.